Fine or we will kill you. That message was mailed to Travis County District Attorney Jose Garza's home address. He says it's just one in a series of escalating threats of violence against him over the last two years. And it's why the Travis County Commissioner's Court approved thousands of dollars in county funds to be used for security measures and protection. But the move drew some criticism and sparked an ongoing legal fight with Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton. KXN's Avery Travis has sat down with the DA. Here's part of their conversation. But this is a part of what comes with this job. Um, and it is just a reality that that I have to live with, but um, you know, while I am living with this reality, I also have an obligation to ensure that the district attorney's office can protect the integrity of our ability to prosecute cases in our office, and I have a responsibility to keep my family safe while I choose to do this job. Um, and so I'm, you know, I am grateful to commissioner's court um, for taking these threats, not only against me, but against all elected officials in the county really seriously, and for taking steps to address those threats. Were you in fear for your life? Um, you know, to be honest with you, um, I don't have a lot of time in this job to, to think about, to think about that. To th and we also asked DA Garza efforts to block some public records from being released related to those security measures. You can hear much more of that conversation. It's online right now in the investigative section of KXAN.com.